This is a river, extremely polluted by industries. There are hundreds of leather, textile, cooking oil refinery and others that pollute this river. With heavy pollution this river has zero dissolved oxygen and has become completely black. Digestion without oxygen is taking place. It is known as anaerobic digestion. This is the primary reason for its blackness. The river has gone completely septic. We collected this polluted river water to test it. Test samples were sent to the lab to test for its chemical properties. Let's try to artificially aerate the sample water. Oh, disgusting rat-tailed maggots were found. We are using aquarium pump to aerate this black water. Initially, both waters are black in color. Continuous aeration was done to see if there will be any changes. Change in color was seen in two hours of aeration. After one day, visible change in color was seen. This is after two days of aeration. The non-aerated water became further black, whereas the aerated water has changed much in its color. This shows that how aeration has a good effect on the polluted waters. This is by preventing the rivers from going septic. While testing, we also tried coagulation with alum as well. We also tried coagulation on initial sample water. The coagulation with alum also showed good results in clearing this polluted river water sample. In fact, aeration and coagulation are the methods already in use in wastewater treatments. Controlling pollution in the first place should always be the target for a clean river.